here with the Alfa Romeo Tonali. This is the first time that it's been seen in Ireland. We're really excited about it. What a stylish car. Let's have a look around it now and get a better sense of it. Classic Alfa Romeo here, isn't it? When we take a look at the front end, all the usual shapes and creases that we've come to expect. Signatures across the lights as well. Big chunky grilling, a bit of kind of plastic, black plastic trim around the bottom and our offset number plate. Let us know what you think of the looks. Classic styling on the wheels that we've come to expect from Alfa Romeo. Today here with the beautiful red Brembo four pop ventilated disc brakes. And we're on 19 inch rims here. Car will be available in various assortments from 18 right up into 20. We have an electronic tailgate on the Alpha, which is very, very welcome. Really helps you when you've got heavy bags in your hands and things like that. Now, I do like the aperture of the back of the Tonala. You can fit a lot in there. So if you do have buggies or a little bit of furniture, big bags, you can just slide them in. We've got a flat floor there as well, but the boot is actually modular. So if you lift that up, you can slide down the part and it rests just a little bit lower to give you more capacity when you want it few little hooks there just to tie on coats and bags you got a little 12 volt socket in the back pretty functional boot in and around 450 liters so plenty of space for most people there and we do like that electronic tailgate there we go Now let's check out space inside. So I have this seat set up for me. Now I'm six foot two, so in and around 1.88 meters. That seat set up for me. Let's see what it's like in the back. Yeah, drop in there and plenty of space for the legs. So this car will easily accommodate four or five adults of six foot and even taller. The side profile of the Tonali, it's absolutely fantastic. So this one is sitting on the 19 inch rims and they fill out the arches quite nicely. I like that bit of black plastic trim that just floats around the wheel arches. You can really see the curvature as well, that bowed line that runs all the way from the front fender right the way down the shoulder line of the two doors and hits that light cluster at the back. Really harks back to the classic alphas of olden times. On the interior, thankfully, the aesthetics have carried through. The designers really, really didn't stop on the outside. They carried it all the way through. Real smattering of buttons there on the steering wheels, but everything that you touch, there's a real sense of quality off it. Now, we're never going to quite hit those levels of real luxurious Mercedes and the likes, but it is a pretty high standard. So if you've enjoyed today's video, please do subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, but more importantly, leave a comment down below. Let us know what do you think. Is this something that you're interested in? What's the competition for it? Jump onto the AA website if you're thinking about getting your car insurance renewed, but don't forget that we have home insurance, travel insurance, and breakdown rescue as well. Thank you very much for watching.